Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. How are you guys? Oh, my name is Alma, and please, if you are new to this channel, consider you subscribing if you want some informative uh, content. Okay, uh, for today's video, I will show you on how to apply for the civil service exam at civil service commission please keep on watching on this video because i will be teaching you the step by step and the correct website where you can um, register for the application of the cec sub professional and professional examination okay first guys type mo yung OCS O S C E A S sa search bar sa Google. Click this so that you will be redirected to the client registration homepage. In here, click mo yung choose. Tapos choose mo yung region kung saan mo taga saan ka kung saan ka magtitake ng exam. Click sign up para lumabas yung client registration form. So, fill up your personal information and make sure yung email address mo is active. Kasi doon is a send and link to verify your account. So, once you are done, go to your email, access your email, then click the link to verify your account. Pag na-click, na muna yung link so verified na yung account mo so you can uh, log in sa OSIS uh, www.osis.cec.gov.ph so ito na po yung hitsura ng dashboard so yung classification guys uh, subgroup or proof so so yung, so yung type of examination guys ano yun ah uh, Paper, paper or pen or and computerized pili ka kung anong gusto mo then go to the schedule of examination a date of examination then tingnan mo sa slot kung meron ba sa area mo kung sa taga saan ka tingnan mo kung saan ka saan testing center na gusto mo once you have chosen your uh, prepared slots or schedule, uh, you will be redirected to the filling up of application form for the examination. So, ito guys, or oh, itong form. Dapat, you have to uh, fill it up uh, legibly. Then, you, also, you must also read your uh, valid ID. Kung anong gusto mong valid ID na gagamitin mo, dapat back to back, front at saka back at when you upload it on the website guys, dapat nakashoot siya sa box kasi mara-rejected then dapat yung ID mo, readable siya hindi blur and also guys, don't forget your to read your kana, photo, your photo na yung standard na required sa CEC is yung my name tag at signature, so Yun guys, ang um, i-ready mo tapos i-upload mo din yun. So, dapat shoot na shoot siya sa box when you upload it. Kasi in my time guys, I was um, reaching uh, to one hour to before nga na successfully uh, submitted yung application ko. Kasi lagi nilang nare-rejected. I don't know why. So, siya nga pala guys, pati consent form guys, pipil apart mo din yun. And take note guys ha, yung application form, uh, yung consent form, ID, at saka yung photo, kailangan mo dalhin lahat yan when you going to the CEC to settle the payment. Uh, be reminded lang guys, uh, to process the application form, you will be given one hour. So one hour lang siya. 
Then, kapag na-submit mo na, then natanggap na sa CEC, tapos naka-receive ka na ng uh, notification na successfully submitted yung application mo, you really have to wait 2 to 3 days para sa schedule sa appointment going to the CEC to settle the payment. So, i-click mo lang to guys. Uh, yung icon na yun sa pinakadolo, yung icon na yun sa dashboard. So, doon ka lang mag-set ng uh, create ng appointment. So, dyan lang. Tapos, yan lang. Um, then, punta ka na sa CEC. That's all lang, guys. Then, thank you very much for watching and, and I hope you like this video. And please, uh, hit the like button and subscribe to this channel if you like and share this video. I hope to see you on my next video. Thank you very much.